So Mondo, tell us about your avant-garde look. When I was a kid, I used to have this electric uh, racing car set. We used to actually turn off the lights to see the sparks coming off of the track, you know? These are like, represent the, uh, the track. And also like, you know, the pit crew, they have like those coats with the lining of the quilt and whatnot. And then down to the guy at the end of the place with those flags. I see so much of you in this dress, which I love. You had such an opportunity to really nip in the waist, and perhaps if you'd sort of brought those, those tracks in a little, rather than having them straight, and where you've accentuated the bust, I think you could have done the same with her shaping, perhaps. Or if you wanted to do a more, I don't know, 65, then you would have pulled it out a bit. But I think they're just a little straight up and down. But it, I mean, it looks great. It's a really good thought out head to toe look, which I, which I think for this looks great. I love the use of technology. It goes like chaser lights in a limousine. I like it. And I'm mad about using the lights in the hair. That's the best part of the whole thing to me. I wonder how avant-garde this dress is, though. To me, it's not so avant-garde. It's just a short, strapless dress with miles of decoration. The boobs? The boobs are not avant-garde, do you think? Well, they're like old Cadillac wings. I put strangely delightful. Good. <laughs> and quirky. Good. Thank you very much, Mondo. Thank you.